Hey guys, Diane Burrows here with birdsupplies.com and today I want to talk with you about all the things that you can do when you have a nice high quality bird carrier for your pet. So they're more than just something to use to take your bird to the vet. I use my bird carriers for a number of of different purposes. And so I've got several different styles. I've got the Paco Bird Bird Carrier that is an actually a, a canvas style backpack carrier that my birds can see out of the screen mesh and uh, I use that for hiking and whatnot. I've also got um, like a, uh, a bird carrier called a Perch and Go which has stainless steel doors for lots of ventilation and it's made of a, a polycarbonate material that's uh, real high impact resistant um, and it's great for the car or and a number of other purposes that I'll get into and then I've got some other bird carriers that I use for evacuation and stuff and so with four birds I've got about eight bird carriers um, you know, in my closets and stuff but I use bird carriers a lot and, and I always have them handy um, to you know use on a moment's notice so for one thing uh, one thing you can do with your bird carriers is always have them ready for, in case of an evacuation need so you know I live here in Colorado and I've had to evacuate uh, a couple of times for fires but you know this week with the weather being all crazy with this polar vortex that we had you know the temperatures plunged to like minus 15 and I had my bird carriers and my evacuation kit ready just in case I lost electricity because um, you know that's what they were saying is um, the emergency services were saying you know if you uh, lose electricity you know you're probably not going to survive when it's 15 below zero um, your house your house won't stay warm for very long and so I always have bird carriers ready for evacuation I keep them cleaned and stocked the perches inside so that in a moment's notice I can just gather up my birds and I know how to put them exactly in my car and uh, you know make a quick getaway if I need to now another thing that I like to use a bird carrier for, especially like say the perch and go, the one with the stainless steel mesh, or I mean the stainless steel doors and, and the polycarbonate, is I like to use a bird carrier as a hospital cage. The stainless steel doors allow me to attach what's called a snuggle up cage warmer onto the bird carrier. In case my birds get sick, I can warm them up and make sure that they don't go into shock. And I can also monitor uh, how they're doing through the clear uh, sides and um, the just the way it's all set up, uh, my birds have food easily accessible and uh, they can just rest in quiet and safe peace without me worrying about them if they start showing signs of feeling unwell or, you know, even sickness. And then the, the next handy thing with that is that if they are already in this hospital bird carrier I, and I need to rush them to a vet, I, can, I don't have to disturb them any more than is necessary. Now, a third thing that you can do with a bird carrier is use it as a sleep cage. So a lot of people call me up and they have birds that have night frights or uh, terrors and that kind of thing. Maybe they have uh, they get nervous at night and, and have separation anxiety. And so uh, that keeps them up at night, but also they get injured and stuff. And then when they once they get injured at night, then it just kind of self-fulfills that anxiety that they have with the nighttime. Um, loneliness and stuff and so having a sleep cage uh, where your bird firstly isn't going to fall far if it falls off its perch uh, secondly it's much more contained so it's not going to flap around and get its wing feathers caught in the cage bars or anything and third you can move it to a quiet area in your room uh, maybe even in your bedroom sometimes if the bird has separation anxiety and let your bird get a good night's rest um, you know in a safe location so using your bird carrier as a sleep cage is uh, an, another function of them now uh, my birds I don't have a whole lot of company and I don't have any kids at home anymore um, so you know when when there is a lot of company my birds get nervous and they need kind of a safe haven if you will and so sometimes I'll have to use the bird carriers as a safe haven you know to keep the birds away from the company and uh, keep them away from the hustle and bustle of the holiday season and that sort of thing and um, then of course the pack of, the pack of bird that I have I love so much is a really nice canvas style backpack carrier and I use that a lot it's very lightweight uh, I use it for kiwi my little green cheek Kanye the most and um, I'm able to take her outside on little walks, dog dog walks and hikes and that sort of thing. And it's really enriching for her to be able to get out, get the sunshine that she needs to get that vitamin D and, you know, just enjoy being part of the family. And finally, I have used 
uh, bird carriers as kind of a home away from home. Whenever I'm traveling and I take my birds on a vacation with me, it's nice to have the, a bird carrier, especially one that has a perch on top, um, so that you know they have a familiar, safe place that I can keep them uh, and, and have them riding in the car and stuff. And so a home away from home is a, another purpose that I use my bird carriers for. So with that in mind, you know, you can see that how functional, say a hundred and a hundred and fifty dollar bird carrier has turned out to be. That really allows my, me to keep my birds healthy, safe, and to um, let them have enriching opportunities, you know, with their life. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give me a uh, thumbs up and uh, make comments of, of some of the fun and unique things that you do with a bird carrier with your own bird. Um, and we'd love to hear more about that. Uh, please share our videos with your, with your friends and subscribe to my channel. So have a happy holidays and we will talk later. Bye-bye.